Mercedes-Benz 770. The Mercedes-Benz 770, also known as the Grosser Mercedes, German Ford Big Mercedes, was a large luxury car built by Mercedes-Benz from 1930 until 1944. It is best known from its use by high-ranking Nazi German politicians and other Axis officials before and during World War II, including Adolf Hitler, Paul von Hindenburg, Hermann Göring, Heinrich Himmler, Reinhard Heydrich, Ion Antonescu. Benito Mussolini and Hirohito, many of which were captured in archival footage. Series I, W07 1930-1938. The 770 was introduced in 1930 as the successor to the Mercedes-Benz TYP 630, with the internal code W07. These high-priced cars were mainly used by governments as state vehicles. Reich President Paul von Hindenburg, Emperor Hirohito and Pope Pius XI were among the customers and Adolf Hitler used a 770 from 1931 onwards. 117 W07 series cars were built until 1938. The W07 version of the 770 was powered by an inline eight-cylinder engine of 7,665 cubic centimeters, 467.7 cu in, capacity, with an overhead camshaft and aluminium pistons. This engine produced 150 brake horsepower, 112 kilowatts at 2,800 rpm without supercharging. An optional roots type supercharger, which was engaged at full throttle, would raise the output to 200 brake horsepower, 149 kilowatts at 2,800 rpm, which could propel the car to 160 kilometers per hour, 99 miles per hour. The transmission had four forward ratios, of which third was direct and fourth was an overdrive. The W07 had a contemporary box chassis suspended by semi-elliptic leaf springs onto beam axles front and rear. Dimensions would vary with coachwork, but the chassis had a wheelbase of 3,750 mm, 147.6 in, and a front track equal to the rear track of 1,500 mm, 59.1 in. Series 2 W150 1938 to 1944. The 770 was substantially revised in 1938, resulting in the new internal designation of W150 7. The new chassis was made with oval section tubes and was suspended from coil springs all around, with independent suspension at front and a de Dion axle at the rear. Hydraulic brakes were fitted, compared to the servo assisted mechanical brakes of the prior series. The engine had the same basic architecture as that of the W07, but had been tuned to produce 155 brake horsepower, 116 kilowatts, at 3000 rpm without supercharging and 230 brake horsepower, 172 kilowatts, at 3200 rpm with. The transmission now had five forward ratios with a direct fourth gear and an overdrive fifth. Top speed was around 170 km per hour, 106 miles per hour. A twin supercharged 400 horsepower, 298 kilowatts model was available, able to reach a top speed of around 190 km per hour, 118 miles per hour. A total of five were made. In 1938, the huge W150 was understood to have been the most expensive German passenger car for sale up to that time. Citation needed though it appeared on no price list, the price was published merely as Alf Anfridge upon request. 88 W150 series cars were built before chassis production ended in 1944. The last cars were bodied and delivered in March 1944. Some cars of this model were offered by Hitler as gifts to his allies, namely, Marshal Ion Antonescu of Romania, Benito Mussolini of Italy. Francisco Franco of Spain, Marshal Carl Gustav Emil Mannerheim of Finland and Emil Hatcha of the Bohemian Protectorate. Marshal Antonescu's car, for instance, was bulletproof. Thanks for watching and subscribe.